Are you passionate about food? Do you like creating new and innovative dishes? Do you thrive in fast-paced environments? If all of this excites you, then a career as a chef might be a recipe for success. Chefs manage, plan, direct, and participate in food preparation and cooking activities in restaurants, hotels, institutions, and other food establishments. They supervise other levels of chefs and cooks in the kitchen, ensure that food dishes meet quality standards, and plan and create menus of food options. To get a taste of this enticing occupation, we grilled a chef working here in Alberta. Hi, my name's Jesse and I'm a chef. Chefs are managers who plan, direct, and uh, participate in food preparation and cooking activities. There's lots of opportunities for a chef. You could work in a restaurant like myself. You can work in hotels, nursing homes, hospitals. So there's tons of different places to get started. Here at our restaurant, the different types of chef is we have regional chefs and they oversee multiple locations. Each location also has a head chef. A lot of times that location will have a senior sous chef like myself. And from there we'll have sous chefs and junior sous chefs, line cooks and prep cooks. Food is something that brings people together and, and meals that people share together are oftentimes where amazing stories start or even stories are shared. And that's definitely what created my passion to become a chef. So a typical day here at the restaurant for me changes depending on really what's going on. Generally, I'm here around six or seven o'clock in the morning. I'm checking in with the team to see what we're prepping, what our product concerns are, and then I'll be working with the team in the morning to help them get a good start to their day. From there, we go into our lunch service, checking over food quality throughout the afternoon before having some meetings later in the afternoon and, and heading home. No, but like, how are we gonna make sure that there's no misrotation? The duties and responsibilities of a chef can be wide ranging depending on the restaurant or environment that you're working in. But some of my day-to-day -day duties are training and mentoring our staff, overseeing food quality, as well as looking at our equipment, making sure that the maintenance is upkept on our equipment. A lot of other responsibilities include ordering, looking at food quality, ensuring that the quality of food that comes into the restaurant on our orders is at the utmost top quality. Some of the skills that are required to be a chef are good personal organization, you definitely have to be outgoing to work with all the different staff members on your team. Being an effective communicator is really important in our industry, as well as being positive in the face of uh, setbacks. And it's great to be creative, as well as having a, a good sense for taste and smell. Some of the physical requirements of being a chef is being able to be on your feet for long periods of time. The vast majority of my day is spent on my feet, as well as being able to lift heavy items and being in the heat, it gets uh, pretty hot in the kitchen sometimes. Our working environment is quite a fast paced environment. It's always busy, especially here at our restaurant and there's constantly things going on and adjustments we need to make. And so that's where being an effective communicator becomes very important as a chef. The work hours definitely vary depending on what's going on. At times you'll be working holidays and, and weekends, but it can really be any time of the day. When it comes to education or training to become a chef, almost all chefs have some formal education or training. Most post-secondary institutions or colleges offer training programs, as well as Alberta also has a apprenticeship program for the cook trade. The restaurant industry is constantly evolving and expanding, so there's plenty of advancement opportunities, especially in the restaurant segment, as well as opening your own restaurant, working in hotels or cruise ships lots of opportunities are available. For someone who's interested in becoming a chef, I would just tell them to try it, speak to the chef who's there and, and get a feel for what the environment would be like and, and maybe if that's the right role for you. This career requires stamina, hand-eye coordination, and the ability to remain calm in stressful, fast-paced environments. A keen sense of taste and smell are essential ingredients. Successful chefs are creative, have excellent leadership skills, and work well with others. If that fills your plate, you may want to prepare for a career as a chef. Feast your eyes on more details of this occupation, including training requirements and salary ranges, by going to the occupational profile on the ALICE website. While you're there, check out some related occupations like caterer, cook, and baker. 
Explore the possibilities. Go to alice.alberta.ca.